Hello everyone, this is your favorite friend Uncle Bob, back at you another video, and today we're continuing the blast of the past with Transformers Energon Hotshot, and also his Powerlinks version, so that's off to the side right now. So yeah, you know, this figure really isn't too bad in alt mode, honestly, I like it. Uh, the robot mode is really where it suffers, but get a little bit of close up on that detail. It looks like a frowny face. Because it, you know, uh, yeah, I don't think you can unsee it now, <laughs> but yeah, you know, it looks pretty good, all things considering, honestly. Now, as far as features go, he do can have open doors, which reveals hands, and he technically can open up his hood to reveal an engine block, which is nice. So, yeah, you know, not too bad. Now, as far as accessories, he has three, technically. He comes with a missile. He comes with whatever this is supposed to be. And his actual gun. So, you just want to go ahead and put the missile in. And this kind of does whatever you want it to do. I'm thinking some sort of, like, radar. I don't know. But you can plug this into the alt mode in a couple ways. You can plug it into the what would be the super mode fist or power links fist. You know, that way, kind of that way, but, or you can plug it into this port right here and that, uh, peg. It has on both sides, but you can't really utilize the one on this side for some reason. I don't know why they have it on this side when it's only one side, but okay. So, just kind of wiggle, wiggle, wiggle it in, and there we go. Now you have an armored car. Yeah, and show you his uh, Power Links version. Eh, not much has changed, just color and the missile and that piece. Different shade of orange. But yeah, just to show you everything that has changed. Not too much. Mine, is, again, these are used, so you know, this one's a little bit scratched up on the detailing up here. But eh, it's battle damage. Whatever. So... Anyways, for transformation, you want to go ahead and just remove this, set it off to the side, and you want to go ahead and flip these back, take these blue sections, flip them up, flip them up, flip, flip up, thank you, and extend the legs. Now you can extend them, that's the first click, the second click is that far. And I think it works better for the proportions. So, let's go ahead and raise up the camera. Then this will fold back on a double hinge. Kind of lift these up. Rotate these out so that way you can have room to get your fingers in. And flip them all the way out. Flip out the arms. And come to back. Flip this piece around. Flip around the engine block all the way. Flip that piece back up. Then you want to take it as double hinge and put it right there. And here we have him in robot mode. And overall, not too, too bad. Looks very nice. So, yeah, you know, for articulation in robot mode, the head is on this armature, so it's kind of weird. He can't really look left or right unless you just unhook it. Then he can do all sorts of exorcism things. So... Yeah, I wouldn't recommend doing that. Honestly, these older figures are not made for posability. You know, got this weird ball joint at the shoulders, which I don't know why they just make them hinges. Yeah, whatever. But, you know, can only go forward that far. Back is non-existent. So, and double hinged elbows, which isn't bad. If it didn't look so weird. Nothing at the wrist, waist, legs, pretty much. You get a week. Can you get back? I've not tried. Come on. Okay. You can get back and technically forward is a scary type. You know, and, you know, toe articulation is just up and down. So, yeah, I don't want to expect any dynamic poses from this guy at all. So, but he can also hold his gun. Plugs into either hand just fine. A little bit looser as I just shoot myself. 
just yeah don't shoot yourself kids <laughs> you'll shoot your eye out <laughs> yeah can totally um yeah not the ball joint's kind of weak but you can at least hip fire it so yeah and a little bit of a comparison between his brother and for also this ball joint's very low so mine so yeah so yeah again not much is different so all right now to power links mode we are going to turn this one into pants and the other one will be a shirt so you just want to start by going ahead and returning the arms to vehicle form including flipping down the doors pretty much the upper half is you know vehicle mo or yeah vehicle mode type thing so just go ahead and flip all this around flip 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 and you want to unpick his arms and just rotate them all the way back and there you got pant mode articulation is the exact same oh he does have outward movement so which doesn't help matters at all so yeah all right and now on to shirt mode get that off to the side same thing remove this off to the side and once again just return the upper half to vehicle form so pretty much just repeating the same steps as pants mode oh sorry about that the cat was doing something he, she should not be doing okay <laughs> all right flip all this around then you want to okay. unpeg the arms unpeg there we go there we go now flip them upside down flip up the feet go ahead and split everything down the middle while rotating the thighs at the, or at the knee 180 and kind of collapse it up to the second click then you want to come back here flip this down grab his head just pull it through and rotate it around and just kind of do your best to get it situated you might have to play around with all the joints in here there's no real science to it but yeah there you go, and now we're power links them. Power links hotshot with power links hotshot. Yeah. There we go. Okay, and yeah, you know overall, I th he's not a bad either, honestly. It's just the this torso is looks really long, like yeah. But he can hold the uh, guns. I typically have him power links with Inferno and him with downshift. Just because I think, you know, downshift was the other one I got with this guy at the time. So I just stuck with it. So now articulation is the same, exact same as far as the arms go that you got in robot mode. Nothing's changed. Same thing with the legs. Nothing's changed. So, yeah. Overall, would I say get these figures? I would get this the this one if you had to get just one this one just works better it is i don't know the, the silver on this guy doesn't it just feels off i don't know how to put it but it doesn't feel as good as this yellow plastic so yeah hope you all enjoyed this little blast from the past let me know what you want to see next down in the comments below and with that being said don't forget to like subscribe and i'll see you all next time for another video review